What step entrepreneur can take to stay ahead in a rapidly changing market? Marketing environment is changing rapidly as you just stated. Even if you look at the rules of companies online with regards to cookies and pixeling and how everybody's built traffic to their websites based on remarketing through people that have been cookied and how that's going to be eliminated and it's consistently changing. And so the people that are most vulnerable, the businesses that are most vulnerable are those that have gotten very comfortable to rely almost exclusively their entire revenue, their entire business model on one exclusive plan, on one exclusive vertical. If someone said, okay, my business is doing extremely well. I'm plowing 100% of my effort to online, for example. Everyone that's in this knows that the clicks per keyword have gone up because of the competitive nature on keywords. We just mentioned about the fact that the rules are changing when it comes to cookie and consumers. And so those are the most vulnerable companies. Now the companies that are gonna succeed, to answer your question, they're gonna do well, are those that understand diversification, are those that understand to compete in various different verticals to almost have a business that comprises of multiple businesses. Our business right now is not exclusive to one. It's not exclusively supplying to just one huge chain retailer. It's fun to do that, but we have multiple chain retailers. We have multiple categories that we'll compete in, whether it's a mom and pop, whether it's corporate, whether it's tourism, whether it's direct to consumer. And then you've got, again, different channels. So channels might be awards, it might be pets, it might be events. And so when a company, when an entrepreneur can start thinking of their business as various different silos and separate businesses within a holistic business, that is the sign of a very healthy business. That's the sign of a very healthy entrepreneur, a broad-minded entrepreneur, and an entrepreneur that I would bet my investment on when it comes to getting some good returns in the future. Ooh.